Hey guys, Swift Gamer here, and in today's video, I'll be going over the update that everybody is getting hyped about, which is the import and export DLC coming in December. Now, as you can read in the first screenshot, it says, Savvy CEOs know there's always more for the taking. While special cargo business in southern San Andreas is booming, another opportunity to expand your hold on the city awaits. With GTA Online Import and Export, it's time to muscle into the lucrative and specialized field of high volume exotic car theft. Now, as you can read in the second, it says stealing and dealing high end vehicles is serious business. Building on the supply chains of further adventures in finance and felony, import and export introduces a whole new series of criminal pursuits as CEOs and their organizations boost. Boost, modify, and resell the most wanted vehicles in the city for big profits. It will take talent, coordination, and the tactical use of some brand new special vehicles to get the job done, all while staying one step ahead of the police and rival challengers from across the city and countryside. In the third one, it reads, new vehicle warehouses will house the results of your importing and exporting operations while CEOs can also reap the fruits of their labor with expansions to the executive office buildings. Add massive executive office garages with up to three floors of showroom quality storage for as many as 60 vehicles complete with customizable decor and a custom auto shop. Now in the last one, you can see it reads, stay tuned for more details about import and export, including a glimpse at all new special vehicles that deliver a unique breed of vehicular mayhem and destruction to GTA Online. Now guys, in this last one, I'm going to assume that this car is based off the Fast and Furious car from Fast and Furious 6, the ramp car. If you haven't seen it, I'll put a picture of it in the end of the video. And guys, most likely, we won't be receiving a trailer until maybe a few weeks from now, or we might not even receive one at all, but I highly doubt that, because Rockstar usually does release a trailer for about every DLC. I think there was only one or two that they didn't release one for. But as you can see, this car looks pretty cool. I don't know if this was going to be a Pegasus vehicle or vehicle that we can put in our garage. I do hope it's one that we can put in our garage. Bitch, I wanna party like we 